did this happen? How did this happen? We were on top of the world. Red hot wheel of mud season. A Super Bowl ring, the parade and everything just to fall from grace. Maybe my first ever winless season. Loss after loss after loss. This is rock bottom. And today, Will of Mutt, the redemption season. You know what? I got nothing to complain about. Yeah, it was a horrible, horrible last season. But great comebacks start with great deficits. And I've got some incredible new players to add to this team before we embark on the redemption season. And listen, I know I'm prestige god. So let's talk about it. Number one, guess who got offensive player of the year? Justin Jefferson, 93 no more. But that's not all. Because cornerback Sauce Gardner also got defensive rookie of the year. We have two insane new cards to add to this team. And what better way to kick off the redemption season than by adding those studs? Almost a million coins for deep threat wide receiver 97 overall Justin Jefferson. Of course this was gonna be an amazing prestige. Was anyone confused? Justin Jefferson at 6 foot 1 has 97 speed faster than Tyreek kill 98 jump 95 catch 98 spec insane route runs an end game wide receiver who will literally be wide receiver one on my team until i add a gold 99 at the end of the year this is so 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 good no question he's absolutely spectacular and he gets really good ability buckets so let's actually start there before we go anywhere number one an option between four different free abilities short in elite is the best way to beat man coverage deep out elite is crazy Easy for jump balls and corner outs. I know route tech used to be incredible. I'm not sure just how good it is anymore. I'm actually gonna go with route tech. If he's not getting the separation I want, I'm gonna switch this to short in elite. I'm also gonna give him red zone threat for improved catching versus single coverage in the red zone. So route tech and red zone threat for one total AP on Justin Jefferson. Gotta give him double me. That's one AP for the whole thing. Spectacular prestige. And we're just getting started because we haven't even got to Sauce Gardner. Now, I don't know if you guys saw, but I went on the NFL's gaming show to play Sauce Gardner and Madden. Oh, we on two different TVs. Okay, we on two different TVs. And it was this big media thing because Sauce Gardner was using Mike White at QB instead of Zach Wilson. Oh! It was totally fraudulent though because Madden just starts Mike White by default and he wasn't gonna switch it. But I thought it was funny. They talked about it on Good Morning Football and I tweeted at them. I was like, no, you fucking bozos. That's not true at all. Regardless, just wanted to flex that I played Sauce and Madden. <laughs> beat him in overtime. He's 6'3", 195, 97 speed, 98 excel, insane coverages, 90 play rec. He's, he's, he's fucking insane. It's almost a golden ticket. I don't want to be like way too dramatic, but he's 97 speed and he's 6'3". He's the best corner in the game until golden tickets come out, really. Which is also why he's 1.5 million coins. 1.46 million coins. Yeah. Speaking of, huge shout out to Instant Madden Coins. If you're trying to get Madden Coins, grab them from there. Code MMG is 10% off. You can buy players coins i recommend getting limiteds and quick selling them love you guys team of the week justin jefferson thank you very much for your service we loved having you but 97 justin jefferson is coming in now you might have also noticed that my power-up legend is still michael irvin i lost so quickly last season i don't think i ever gave michael irvin an option to actually get really really good so i'm still gonna use michael irvin he's the same power-up legend as last season normally i'd never do that but we've also never gone 0 and 3 before so things are changing so i am gonna leave mega Megatron is CB1, and then Sauce will go to CB2. I, it doesn't really matter. They're both gonna have the exact same responsibilities. He's boosted to a 98. He has plus three play rec, thanks to my strategy item, which is actually really big on him. 99 zone, 98 press. I don't know what abilities he gets, though. Oh my god, just so many good ones. Well, deep route, medium router for man coverage, which I don't run a lot of. A 1 AP acrobat. Oh, that's so good. Acrobat's usually 5 AP. I could get deep out for 4. It's actually a very difficult decision. I think deep out zone Zone KO is just too important. So I'm gonna have to run deep out zone KO. Although I will I will consider switching that to Acrobat. I love Acrobat. We're gonna go with the free pick artist for zero AP. No questions about that. And the rest of this is main coverage stuff, which I don't use. I'm gonna give him universal coverage, and that is one 
MVP on Sauce Gardner for Pick Artist and Deep Out Zone KO. That is spectacular. All we have to worry about now is CB3 and free safety because I've got a Prestige strong safety and two corners. So that's huge. Not to mention, team of the year voting just came out. TJ Hawkinson is an option. Micah Parsons is an option. So if you guys want to do me a favor and vote for Micah and TJ Hawkinson, we'll get two more team of the year prestiges and I legitimately will be crowned the greatest prestige man of all time. Now that everything's in, we're ready to go. We interrupt our program to bring you this important message. I've been a little embarrassed with the quality of content I've been putting out lately. I want to keep upping it and keep making it better and I'm determined to do that. So today's video is going to be a fucking heater. I'll tell you that right now. I love you boys. It's redemption season. Hop on the trainer. Hop off you little bitch. Let me see what we got first. Woo! Dude, I, I got this from that stupid ass trend where you double it and give it to the next person. Do you want 16 mugs or double it for the next person? I fucking hate TikTok. I came up with a good idea. I can either spend 100K on a player right now or I can get no player. And if I win, it doubles to 200K. Later in the season, I might consider the gamble, but not today. And we're just gonna get a filler quarterback, a quarterback who's gonna get the job done for us in today's episode. Probably not our end game quarterback, but somebody that'll make it work. I think with 100K and only no. Where do I go free safety? Now, I feel like I do need a quarterback for sure. I kind of want to go Malik Willis. Oh, I can't afford Justin Fields. I'm going Malik Willis. 76,000 coins for Malik Willis. He's a scrambler QB with 93 speed, 94 throw power. His accuracies are okay. He's probably not going to get great abilities. But since this isn't my endgame quarterback anyway, I'm actually really happy. Is that how you pronounce his last name, by the way? Would you guys mind, like, maybe just sending me a voice memo? How do you say it? Say it out loud with me right now. Malik Willis Dick. Willis Dick fit in your mouth. I own you fraud. If you said that out loud, I actually fucking own you. You are my property now. I like my coffee black. Can't you see we talking white? By the way, since I own you now and you're gonna make my coffee, you know what else I like black? <laughs> No, no. I would like this video to stay on the internet. Abilities, we're gonna give him run and gun. He's actually the perfect guy for run and gun. I give I give run and gun to everybody, so that's not really fair. The free abilities he gets. Oh my god, he gets okay. What fucking bozo gave Malik Willis a four AP set feet lead and a three AP set feet lead? Him getting set feet lead is actually awesome at a discount. He really doesn't get anything else. All these are way too expensive to justify. So I'm not gonna be rocking with any of these, but set feet lead. All right, good start. No gambling today. I'm not doubling it, but down the line, I may. That takes us to wheel spin number two. We're starting out with a quarterback, Malik Willis. I think it's a great start. Our next one is it's unopened pack choice. As you guys know, whenever there's a crazy good pack in the store, I save it in unopened for Wheel of Mud. The absolute best one, like the most fucking cracked one, is limited fantasy pack. But the limited fantasy pack only gives you one player. And my team is very sparse right now. This all pro star fantasy pack, I believe this gives you multiple players. I'm just gonna peek at it real quick just to check. Oh wait, no, no, no. I'm not. I'm not peeking at that. No, because I don't want it. I don't want it. Because what I want is this one right here. The three times 93 plus elite fantasy players. So this guarantees I get three players out of five total who are all 93 overall or better. This is what we need right now. Every, almost every single position is going to be crucial. First one's a playoff player. Holy shit. 96 Hassan Reddick out of the 93. Huge start. Huge start. He's, uh, there's almost 100% sure I'm taking him. He's going to go right across from Micah. Hassan Reddick legend. That won't be very good. Most likely. Ooh, Tony G. Unlikely that I take him here. I already got Hawkinson. All mad in 94. Four would make that. I technically could take that. I was thinking if you can have both them on your lineup, you definitely can. I could have this Megatron in my Prestige Megatron, which feels weird. We need a different position. Yes! No 93s either! The final one is a... Ooh. It's only 93, but it's low-key the best option. Hassan Reddick's guaranteed. We take Hassan Reddick. We take Javon Curse. Do I take Zion Johnson? I'm taking Zion Johnson. Two defensive players, one offensive. We had offensive threats, but I've got Hawkinson and, and Jay Jettas. I can't justify those others. Post up for one would be really nice. I'm gonna give them both for right now. So three AP on Zion Johnson. In the long run, I'll probably just do one AP post up. I played Madden with Zion Johnson too. Since we're talking about it, you guys are gonna love this story. Zion Johnson plays for the Chargers. Will Cloud also now plays for the Chargers. 
Chargers. And Zion Johnson comes up, big dude. And he's like, yo, MMG, right? And I was like, hey, what's good, Zion? I didn't know you'd know me. He goes, bro, Will Claps on our squad now. He talks about you. And I was like, no way. That's the coolest shit ever. It made me so happy. I was like, bro, please tell Will, like, hi from me. He's the GOAT. Yeah, I thought you guys would like that. So Hassan Reddick and Micah are both left outside linebackers. I think Hassan Reddick's gonna get to the QB faster than Micah is until Micah gets team of the year. He gets a discounted no outsiders and secure tackler. He also gets speedster, tip drill, doubler, nothing. How bizarre. I'm gonna give him no outsiders. I'm gonna worry about the abilities on Hassan Reddick, Javon Curse later. I need to see my whole defense before I can decide that. All right, that takes us to our third and final wheel spin. We've done very well so far. I'm not entirely sure what I would add right now. Ooh. I don't have a choice. TVP until a 90 plus. So I get to open training variety packs until I get a player that is 90 overall or better. Now, a lot of training variety packs are the platinum elite players. So we're probably gonna go through a lot of those until we get a series redux or potentially we could get a limited. If we got a limited, I'd go fucking nuts. I don't even know what I would do. I'm not gonna plan on that. I don't think that's gonna happen. It would be so nuts though. Dude, do you guys remember when I pulled an all Madden reroll and I got 94 Jason Kelsey? Dallas Goddard. Hey, hey, oh. Oh, wait, that's a strategy item. Christian McCaffrey. Bull Rush. We interrupt our program to bring you this important message. If Jimmy G wasn't so handsome, do you think Jimmy G would have gotten the same contract and played as much as he has? I know this. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, it's an 87. Damn it. I thought we were getting a 92 right there. Like, to what degree does Jimmy G being such a good face, literally a face of a franchise, play? I might just be full of shit, but I've been thinking about that recently. What do you mean by that? Like, bro, look at how much shit Kyler Murray gets for being shit. Short. Number one, he's 5'10", so he's not that short. Oh! You know what? We will totally take this. I was in the middle of saying something probably really stupid, so I'm just gonna shut up, and I'm gonna take Dalvin Thomas, and this is totally fine. 80 speed, 83 excel, great block check, great power moves, and I've got Javon Curse on one side, so he can go on the other, or he does have secondary position as a D-tackle. I think I am gonna make him a D-tackle, and I wanna see what abilities he gets. If you get inside stuff, this is the best day ever. He gets no outsiders as well. He gets out my way. Gets inside stuff for two. I'm gonna give him inside stuff for two. I really need inside stuff on this team. I've got him at secondary position D tackle and I got myself a 92 overall. Beautiful. We got ourselves a quarterback. We don't have a halfback, but guess what? We technically do have a halfback because we have Christian Okoye who is an amazing halfback despite being a fullback. Uh, I've got Bruiser on him already, so he's gonna go ham and our fullback will just turn into Xander Horvath. Atito Ogbani is gonna come out for Dalvin Tomlinson, who's now my inside stuff. Hassan Reddick can stay at left outside. I'm gonna move Micah to right outside. Palomalu will continue to be my user sauce and megatron the biggest problem we have today is no free safety no corner we saw what elijah hicks and christian matthew did in the first episode of last season it was atrocious we got absolutely tore up best case scenario i'd say is like my opponent gets really frustrated early and tilts or rage quits defensively i gotta figure out what we're putting on hassan reddick these abilities are so weird i guess i go no outsiders i will go speedster i don't know much about blocker resistance and how it works but i'm gonna run it i'm not gonna run edge start elite because I think Javon Curse is gonna get it actually discounted. He gets edge threat for two, huge. And he gets under pressure for one. That's basically edge threat elite. So if our opponent's quarterback does not have fearless, they actually will be in trouble. <laughs> of course, the challenge wheel. As we know, the challenge wheel tends to be absurdly clutch in this first episode. It has been for the past two seasons. Philadelphia Eagles QB sneak special. I must score from the one yard line if I want to complete my challenge. No fly zone, JJ. That's our top three sauce. JJ Jetta's Megatron. Gold 99 Brady, Isaiah Hodgins, and the Grave Digger. I just have really questionable safeties up there. Ooh. No, that's... Elijah Hicks. Oh, nice recovery. Palomalu. Does he do it again? He does not. He checks down. Oh, nice move. And that's Tyson. Tyson Anderson. Nice work, buddy. Just the five wide classic from this guy. Middle, high, low. I knew he was going there. Palomalu. Go. Go. You gotta go. Do it. Palomalu is gonna take this. I knew it! At the last second, you could see he hot routed his halfback. He stared it down. I need every point I can get. I'm not gonna win this game conservatively. I'll tell you that right now. Let's go, Malik. Let's go, Malik! Let's go! Ah, oh, the predetermined rollout. I don't know what the hell Malik Willis was doing at the end of that play. Eight. Oh, wait, wait. Watch Malik Willis here. Will we get to see his celly? What the fuck is he doing? I'm gonna go on Elijah Hicks here. RPO. Palomalu. Good hit. Oh my god, you fucking-
fucking sketch ball. I was so close to that. What a disgusting angle to throw into, though. Holy shit. I tell you what, though, this is such good news. This guy is throwing some weird passes. Kyle Phillips? Oh my god, Kyle Phillips, the silver, is gonna take off for 34 yards first play. When the world needed him most, Kyle Phillips showed up. All right, I'm just gonna go inside zone Okoye once again. This looks so free. I know I got some bums in there, but look at that. Go Malik. Go Malik! Yup, there's Okoye. Great block on the user. Okoye plus one! Let's go. Get your ass down there, Okoye! Once again, I could have technically stopped on the one somehow there. I'm too scared, man. I'm taking everything I can get in this game. I hope you bet the over. I hope you bet the more, actually. I, I work with prize picks now, so it's more or less, not over under. Code MMG, $100 deposit match on prize picks. I'm gonna get returned on doing my prize picks ad. That's why I said I got sky kicked to the fullback. I, I literally said at the start of this game, and I literally... <gasps> yeah, you bitch! Yeah, you like that showbo? Yeah, you just got flagged down. I hope, I pray, I pray we stand you up right now. Doesn't do the whip route. Goes down to Javon Curse. I sniff that whip route out. Javon Curse, amazing, amazing pressure there. Oh, I'm there. Oh, I pray we stop him here so that his touchdown was for nothing or that his showboat was for nothing. Let's get some pressure on the QB. Oh, big hit. Hey, you know what? That was a silver right there. He was not going to make that tackle. I can't guess pass because I actually don't know that this is a pass. This could very well be a run. It's not. Passing. Scrambling. Damn. Dude, the 99 career tribute Tom Brady has 94 speed. That's faster than Malik Willis. Why? He's got inside stuff on Javon Hargrave. But I've got secure protector on Jason Kelsey. Secure protector shuts down inside stuff. It's the counter. So I actually can run the ball against him. Where normally that inside stuff's going ee and grabbing my hat back and just tackling me right then and there. This is man, but Hawkinson's got him. I'm gonna cut this up. Oh, beauty. Let's go, Okoye! We're gonna keep this clock moving here. Does that safety help? A, clear, clear. Tight window, Ogletree! The silver, Andrew Ogletree! Jefferson, it's there. Oh! I'm gonna maintain the eight-point lead until he forces my hand. He heaves one. Oh, that's a big mistake. Oh, I come down with that. We get in field goal range, make it a two possession. Throw the post. Throw the post. Throw the post. <gasps> get there. Get there, P. What a catch. <gasps> Elijah Hicks. Let's fucking go, Elijah. Bro, that's the cover. That's the cover four, cover three beater that's always been in Madden. You send everybody then that deep post, and he just could not execute. It's not letting me adjust my halftime stuff, but that's okay. Dude, look what Tarn just made me. Oh, Tarn's my really jack friend you guys always see. You used to play Fortnite with me, bro. Just... He keeps bailing out. Quit bailing out. His favorite defense is cover four drop, but inside zone just tears this up. You're gonna have to force me to stop. I am, I am averaging 10 yards per carry with two offensive linemen and three junior varsity silver players. I think Okoye is open. We're gonna take that throw. Oh, get through him. Yup, that's a little corner. And that's a first down every single time. Malik Willis, five for six, 116 and a touchdown. I think Okoye is open on the left. After the leak out, he up. Let's go. That's huge. That's huge! I love you! Now we slow the game down. Slow the game down. Let's try and get all the way to the fourth quarter. Kick a field goal and make this a two-possession lead. I'm going to go back at Lawrence Taylor. This might be tough. I'm going to try it. Oh, excellent. Are you kidding me? I'm going to try it. I can't believe I have the balls to do this right now. Secure protector. Oh, my God. I got Jason Kelsey. He's the perfect guy for this. <laughs> I watched the Super Bowl. I know how unstoppable that is. Two possession lead. A perfect fucking game for Malik Willis. And our challenge wheel is complete. So I could either salvage a wheel spin in a loss or take one of any pack in the store with a win to the playoffs. No, 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 Matt. Why? Why did you just kick off? I just got to make a play. Hell of a fucking open field tackle. Deja vu, buddy. You couldn't return it last time. And what happened? Oh, wait. Just kidding. Last time he scored. Oh, it's a run. It's a read option. Put it away, Palomalu. Put this shit away. Ooh. No, he's not in, is he? I'm run committing middle. No way. I just ran commit middle. It's a nine-point game right now, though. Does he go for... He's going for two. I can't believe he's going for two. He's passing. No, he's going to scramble it in. No, he's not. 29-22. Keeps leaving that. Fine by me. You're, you're, that little corner will never make that tackle. Every play, I feel like I kind of got to go yard. Oh, Justin Jefferson's so open. Oh, we manned him up. Genius. 
I, I took off because I panicked. I saw that pocket collapsing. Third and 10. This is now not looking good. I have to convert. I need Justin Jefferson to get open. I think he's there. Oh my God. What a catch. That's not a first. Holy shit. F a spectacular catch. Oh, I'm going. I'm running this ball. Oh, he ran. Commit. He still can't stop it. Let's go, Okoye. Eight rushes, 103 and a touchdown. Could have been two. Oh my God. Another run commit. Malik. Malik, that's a touchdown, man. That ends the game. Might have been the first time today, though, that he missed, like, a pretty crucial throw. So I'm not going to be I'm not gonna be too on his head about it. User. User's out of position. He makes the throw that time. And Okoye continues to carry the team. Malik, I'm not even mad at you because that was the same throw, and you made it that time. I'm going to go inside zone. First and 10. Good blocks. Running left side, cutting it back up middle. Not a lot of yards. I'm going to max protect, and I'm going to scramble. Oh, my God, Malik. Are you going to be able to? He's not. It says punt because Kane York can't hit this. I'm going five wide. Oh no. Does he see it? He doesn't. He doesn't! Ball game! Ball game! Offensive player of the year, Justin Jefferson ends it. Now you're out of your mind if you think I'm not. Coach adjustments, ball carrier conservative. I'm handing this ball off a few times. It's over. Oh my God, what a fucking laser on fourth and 10. Malik Willis keeps delivering. The mailman, bro. He's the mailman. I assume he's run committing now. It doesn't. Oh, sir. If I was a greedy son of a bitch, I'd come out in a pass and try and hit Michael Irvin here. I'm a man who desperately wants to win his ball game. Oh, you bozo. You're a bozo. I wanted my Michael Irvin. You know what we always say? We always say I get a Michael Irvin upgrade if they rage quit. Would I have gotten a Michael Irvin touchdown? Would I have even tried? Maybe not. But I'm going to give him his first upgrade because they robbed me of a chance to try. I was not given a chance to try. That was such a good game. I wish I could have seen the stats. Justin Jefferson iced the game up. Boye had 10 plus yards per carry. Jason Kelsey shut down the inside stuff. TJ Hawkinson had some clutch ones. Andrew Ogletree had a clutch one. And and since I slapped my gigantic gorilla nutsack on the one yard line and QB sneaked it in for a touchdown, I get one of any pack from the store. It's a Gridiron Guardians Volume 2 pack, which contains two 88 plus and one 81 plus elite player. I opened these one time and they were actually so good. I'm going to use my one on the Pro Star Fantasy pack. But let's see what our first round's got. This could just be role players right here. You know what? I guess if, if that's what I got to go with, I will do it. Eee! 91 Ken Norton. That's going to be amazing. I need a middle line linebacker bad anthony harris and josh jacobs so anthony harris ken norton brett Kern on just the first round the second round ah that's not so good that's not so good but this graham glasgow is awesome he won't be a center but he'll be a left guard all right so first things first marquise hayes you honestly threw some good blocks my guy i'm very proud of you but graham glasgow is an 88 at left guard so that's awesome we're gonna throw him in ken norton gets to come in for balen specter 6 2 90 speed what's your change of direction 92 that's a fucking user do you get lurker 2 AP Lurker. No question, I'm running that. Anthony Harris has plus five speed. Anthony Harris, you're still a bum, but welcome to the squad. We made it work today. One and O on the redemption season. I hope you guys love today's Wheel of Mud. I love ya. I can't wait to see how Team of the Year goes. Uh, next time I see ya, it's on me. Appreciate you, boys. Thanks for watching. Talk soon. Peace.